And we're back to learning HTML SVGs. There's a different way to create lines with different points so you don't have to stack these lines and attach them to one another or however you want to call it. You can simply use a polyline and define points and these points will be connected afterwards. But there are a couple of things that we need to take care of. Let us start at the top left with a 0, 0, then 50, 50. So first is always the X position, horizontal line. Second number is the Y position, the vertical line. We'll need to add a stroke to see something and let me make it a little bit thicker right away by adding a stroke width of 5. And now we can see it. It's cut off on the left hand side, so I'll make it to 5, 5. So our starting point, and instead of adding a second line, we can simply add another point. And it will be the third point of our polyline. I'll make it 125. But there's also a problem that it's now being treated as a polygon. So it's getting filled by default. Therefore, we have to set the fill to none. And now we only see the stroke color, which was black. So it is necessary to add to have a line only without a fill. Let's just say we want to have a straight horizontal line. All you have to do is to give it a different x value, but keep the y value, it was 25. And if you want to go down into vertical line, you have to keep the x value, which is 150 here, and change the y value. And this is how you can create these polylines. Obviously, you can change the stroke color just like this. So use a line inside of your SVG whenever you have a single line with two points. But when you have multiple points in a line, it's better to use this polyline. I hope this video was helpful. Thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.